your Grover Mother Realtor. We are back today with our three-part series, How's the Market? Yesterday we did buyers, today we're gonna do sellers, so check it out. Sellers, how are you doing today? A year ago you were doing great, weren't you? But now that it's January 2020-23, you're not doing as great, are you? So, my job as a real estate agent, I'm not a salesperson. I'm not here to just blow smoke up your butt and tell you things that you wanna hear so I can get you to sell your home. I wanna be honest, I like to build relationships, I want to build your trust and gain your trust. So, if you come to me today and say, Romel, I need to sell your home, my home. I would say, how badly do you need to sell your home? Do we need to fix this problem ASAP today? Do we need to go today? If so, awesome, let's list it and let's come up with a strategy to get this thing off the market as quickly as possible. If you can wait, if you can wait a few weeks, maybe a few months, that would be my suggestion. My suggestion is still get with your real estate agent, still get with your realtor, talk about your strategy, go through the home and see what needs to be done. Can you do some cheap little repairs? Can you paint real quick? Can you fix the water heater? Can you afford to do the landscaping to make it more, um, what is that word that I'm like totally missing? Um, can you make the curb appeal come up? Just those few little things, not a lot of money I'm saying. Can you change out the light bulb to make them a little bit more warm? Those type of things because I do think that it'll pick back up during the spring, just in my personal opinion. Please don't come at me with all your like data and stuff that you've gotten from almanacs of whatever. Um, but that's just my opinion that it, it, the market will recover just a bit in the coming months. So if you do not have to sell your home today, as of January, 2023, I would definitely advise in holding off just a tad. But if you do, like I say, come get with the realtor, come up with a strategy. Um, you're not going to give your real estate agent a number. You guys come up with a number, do deep diving of CMAs. A CMA is a comparative marketing analysis. Do a deep dive. Don't just do one or two, do several. Um, make sure you're getting the most accurate data of what you can do, how much you can sell, you list your house for, because that is that's the most important thing, right? Come with a great number. So no, it, it might not be the best time in the world to sell, especially if you want to compare it to last year or even the previous year. What is this? Twenty so two years ago. Maybe it's not the best time, but some people don't have the option. Some people have to sell. So if you do. All you need is a great realtor and some good strategy and patience because your home might not go within the first month or so. So let it let you, you know, patience, good marketing is and good strategy is basically what you need if you have to put your home on the market for sale. And also just like a, just we're gonna brief over this really quickly is I do have a commercial listing. So it's also not a bad time to do some commercial uh, listings and stuff like that because usually investors are not as concerned as things like um, interest rates and stuff like that because they do this all the time. They wait for, what do you do? Buy the drop, buy the low, buy the drop or whatever. So they wait for things like this. They understand the market. They understand that uh, interest rates are very temporary. So if you do have things like commercial listings, it might be a good time those tend to sit on the market longer and um, times like this when sellers are anxious might be a good time to get yourself some commercial listings and some investors in your back pocket because they're not as concerned as things like interest rates and stuff like that. I hope this helps you all understand the market a little bit better as of January 2023. That is very hard for me to say for whatever reason. Um, the market's always changing, so I could probably do this in like a month and have a totally different things to say. But as of today, that's what I gotta say. Tomorrow we will be going to the investor um, side of how's the market. Uh, what are your What do you think? Uh, do you agree with what I said? Do you not agree with what I said? Do you think I'm a total idiot and don't know what I'm talking about? Do you think I'm great and I want you be, want me to be your realtor? I can do that too. You guys, thanks for listening, and as always, holler if you want to talk real estate.